Hello friends this new video tutorial of WebsListen which covered how to upload image without using form submit in PHP as backend and JavaScript jQuery and Ajax as frontend. We have make many image upload video tutorial and all that tutorial we have used form and submit button but in this tutorial we have not used any form submit on button click but when we have select any image it will automatically upload it to its respective folder path. In many social media site like Facebook when we have select any image for upload then it will automatically upload without using button click event or form submit event. So in this tutorial we have make this type of features by using Ajax, jQuery, JavaScript and PHP. This is our file structure there is two file like index and upload and one upload folder. Under this folder we will upload the image into this folder. This is index page and under this page we have used jQuery JavaScript library and bootstrap framework. First we have make one file tag for select image. So we have write input type is equal to file with attribute name is equal to file and it is equal to file. Here when we have select image from this tag it will be automatically upload into its destination folder. Below this tag we have define one span tag with attribute that is equal to uploaded image. Under this tag we will display uploaded image. Now we have move to write jQuery code on file tag change event, because when we have select file from file tag then it will be upload it to upload folder, so we have write dollar with document as selector with on method and under this method we have write change event with file tag add file with function. So when we have select any image form this tag this code will be execute. First we want to get the property of selected image. So we have defined one variable property is equal to document dot get element by it file dot files with zero index. This code will help us to get the property of selected file and store into this property variable. After this we want to get the name of selected file so we have write variable image name is equal to property variable dot name. This will fetch the name of selected file and store into image name variable. Now we want to get the extension of selected file, so we have write variable image extension is equal to image name variable dot split function with dot argument with pop method with to lowercase method. This code will help us to get extension of selected file. After this we want to check selected file extension is match with our allowed file extension. So we have write of statement and in condition we have write jQuery dot an array method with two argument. In first argument we have write selected file extension which we have store an image extension variable and second argument we have write array of allowed extension is equal to minus one. This condition will verify that if selected file extension is not matched with allowed file extension then it will execute if block of code and under this block we have write alert message like invalid image file. After validate selected file extension using jQuery, now we want to validate its size of selected image. So we have define image size variable is equal to property variable dot size. This will get the size of selected file and store into image size variable. Now we have write of statement and under condition we have write value of image size variable is greater than 2 million. Here 2 million means 2 megabyte. This condition will check if value of image size is greater than 2 megabyte then it will execute if block of code and under this block we have write alert message like file size is very big. Suppose selected image size is less than 2 megabyte then it will execute else block of code and under this block first we have create one new variable form data is equal to new form data object. Here we have used form data object for append selected file data into form data variable for upload file to server. 
After this inform data variable we have append property of selected image file, so we have write form data dot append method and in this method first we have defined name file and second argument we have defined property of selected image which we have store into property variable. Now we have start write ajax request and in this first we have write url option set to oppo.php. Here we have send request to this url. In second option we have write method for send data, here we have use post method for send data to server. Third option is data and in this option we can define which data we want send to server, so in this we have write form data variable in which we have append selected image data. Fourth option is content type set to false, here content type used when sending data to the server. Fifth option is cache and it is set to false, it will enable requested pages to be cached. Next option is process data and it is also set to false, it will send DOM document or non-process data file, so it is set to false. After this next option before send callback function, this function has been called before it will send request to server and under this function we have write dollar with span tag it uploaded image with html method and under this method we have write image uploading. So when we have select image then this code will be execute first. And lastly in ajax request we have write success callback function. This function has been called if request has been completed and this function will receive data from server which can be fetched from this data argument. Under this function we want to show uploaded image under span tag with it uploaded image, so we have write dollar with uploaded image it with the HTML method and under this method we have write data argument. So it will display uploaded image under this tag. Now we have moved to write PHP code for upload image, so on this page first we have write of statement and under condition we have write dollar files file name is not equal to blank, this code will check select image name is not equal to blank. So it will validate this page for direct access. So if anyone can direct access then no code will be execute. If select image name is equal to blank then it will execute if block of code and under this block we have write dollar test variable is equal to explode function with first argument string delimiter is equal to dot and string is equal to dollar files file name. This will make array from name of selected image divide name into two array and first array will be name of image and in second array it will be extension of image. After this from this array we want to get the extension of image, so we have write dollar extension variable is equal to end function with dollar test argument. This function will select the value of last array which is extension and store in two dollar extension variable. Now we have create the new name for selected image, so we have write dollar name variable is equal to random function with start hundred and n 999 with string operator with dollar extension variable. It will generate new name of selected image file. After this we have define location for upload image. So we have write dollar location variable is equal to upload folder name with dollar name variable in which we have store new name of image. After defining location for upload image now we have write move uploaded file function with two argument. In first argument we have write temporary location of selected file and in second argument we have write upload location which we have store in dollar location variable. This function will upload selected image file to specified location like upload folder. Now we want to display uploaded file on web page, so we have write echo statement and under this we have write image tag with source is equal to dollar location variable with attribute height is equal to 150 and width is equal to 225 and class is equal to image thumbnail. It will display uploaded image on web page without page refresh. So our code is ready so we have saved this code on check output in browser. Friends you can see that when page has been loaded then you can only see the file tag on web page. 
So first we have select Excel file from our local computer. Here friends you can see the alert message like invalid image file, so we have select image with size more than 2 megabyte. Again friends you can see that alert message like image size is very big, so our validation done by jQuery JavaScript is working now we have select proper image with proper size and check result. Friends you can see that when we have select image first it display message like image uploading and in few seconds image has been uploaded under upload folder and it is also display on web page without page refresh. So our code working on how to upload image without using form submit or button. In current time you can see on many website, when we have select image and it is automatically upload to server without using any form submit event. This code is working on most of the latest browser. We have already post blog on this topic on our official webs listen blog, and we have provide that blog link under video description link. From that link you can find the online source code of this video tutorial and online demo also. So you can also check online demo also. If you want to get more update regarding our video tutorial please subscribe our YouTube channel. If you have any query regarding this video tutorial, please comment your query and if you like this video please share with your friends or even you can also share on social media also.